नमस्कार ए वेरी वॉम वेलकम टू ईच वन ऑफ यू टू आवर टूडे सेशन इज गोइंग टू बी वेरी स्पेशल बिकॉज वी हैव विद एस उमा जी शी इज अ मास्टर यू कैन सी हेर ऑन द स्क्रीन she is a master teacher and a worldwide of soul healing india and she is a worldwide representative of the great spiritual master and healer master z gang sha i met uma ji sometime in 2010 and this was a time when master sha visited india on several occasions because he had this message from the divine that india is ready for soul healing so he came here he visited many cities held many programs and i attended quite a few programs and that is when i met uma ji and we forged a friendship and camaraderie which has been lasting and i did attend a lot of programs of soul healing but later on because of certain compulsions i was not able to join the practice sessions so often and i was not able to continue with it but perhaps the gurus were charting a kind of a similar path for me which was unique so <laughs> after i started sound healing we have been myself and uma ji have been collaborating she is a frequent guest on our programs and sometimes she gives me an opportunity to do sound healing for the participants in the sessions that she is offering <clears throat> and that is what we have learned that we can always sort of co-opt each other one another and cooperate with one another and it brings a bigger variety to people because the job is to offer healing to be able to serve and uma ji has been doing this job brilliantly for the last so many years and you will know that till the depth of her experience and understanding and ability when she speaks to you so i will not stand between you and uma ji any more so uma ji the session is yours and thank you so much for being here and we are so grateful thank you dr sir thank you so much your association with soul healing india with master transmission and with all that we do together is it's really something commendable and i deeply deeply appreciate it and every time i hear some uh, someone saying that the sound healing works so well for them it gives me joy it feels it feels so nice that you know somewhere someone is getting a smile on their face for ultimately that is our mission in life to help people to relieve pain to bring back a smile so that is the only thing that's going to work well for us that is going to serve us So thank you very much for this wonderful opportunity. Welcome everyone. Many of you are very familiar faces, and some of you are a little new, maybe. So I am, as Dr. Sir said, my name is Uma Rajan, and I have been a student of Master Shah since the year 2010, and it's been a wonderful journey. Being a seeker right from the beginning. I have been Swami Chidmayananda was my first guru, and from there, you know, just step by step by step, and ultimately, when that urge came, and you know that I need to be with that living guru, and Master Shah came in the picture, and I don't know somewhere something, everything just fell into place, and I have not looked back after that. It's been a, as I said earlier, it's a pleasure to see, you know, when you can. you can be a a channel to bring a smile on someone's face it really makes your 
feel that you know it's worth being alive so today's session i would love to share with you about how we can transform blockages in our seven chakras so master shah's teachings he calls it the seven soul houses while in indian traditions we call them the chakras master shah taught speaks of these energy centers as seven soul houses because depending upon our our living our spiritual ascension our soul is, is always sitting in one of those seven soul houses and presently master shah talks of dao technology which is dao calligraphy dao healing dao song and dao water so today we'll be touching upon dao song as well as a little bit of dao calligraphy to receive healing for our seven soul houses our seven chakras and there is another space in front of the spinal column right from the top of the skull to the base of the torso which we call the y jaw which is a very very big space one of the biggest spaces in our body where most of the blockages tend to go and accumulate so we will also be doing chanting to clear those blockages so i would love each one of you to cooperate and do the practices along with me okay in master shah's teachings everything is done by the four power technique which is body power mind power sound power and soul power body power as we all know is where we place our hands how we place our hands that's where we receive the healing blessing so for this we'll be placing our palms one palm will remain constant on our lower abdomen and the other palm will keep moving from each soul house from the first will ada chakra till the top of the head so i will guide you how you can move your palm so that is your body power mind power you will be visualizing beautiful light radiating in that particular chakra or soul house as we do the chant sound power will be certain vibrational sounds that are made which will activate which will help to clear the blockages in the various chakras the various soul houses and the soul power is the say hello greeting just like each one of us love to be addressed like if i see if i see admiti and i tell her hello admiti she will really like it right everybody likes to be addressed so soul power is say hello so say hello to every part of your being so today we'll be saying hello to our seven chakras to the vajra area and requesting them to heal and clear themselves so let us start we'll sit up straight if you're sitting on a chair i would like you to keep your, both your feet flat on the floor but if you're sitting on a on the sofa or you're sitting cross legged it's perfectly okay So you can keep your spine as erect as you can. Please boy, follow your body conditions. If health does not permit you to sit in a particular position, perfectly okay. Be comfortable. End of the day, you need to be comfortable, but not over comfortable. Okay. So you can sit up straight, and you can gently. I will be sharing the screen so that you know. the mantras that we will be chanting so just give me a minute okay so this is the universal man and you have the seven colors going up 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 and this dotted line that you see is the y jaw that is the area in front of the spinal column okay so let us start with the first soul house the muladhara chakra you can sit up straight and focus on the muladhara chakra the first soul house the area between the anus and the genital organs at the base of the torso 
at the perineum. It's a fist sized center and we will be visualizing bright red light in that area. And the sound that we will be using is the mantra A. H E I A. Okay? So I'll do the soul power for all the seven soul houses and the white here. And then we will go ahead and do the practices. So you can repeat after me in your minds. Your soul, mind and body of all my seven soul houses and Vajjiao, I love you. You have the power to heal and rejuvenate yourselves. You have the power to heal and rejuvenate the organs around you. Do a good job. There are the mantras for the seven soul houses. As we chant the mantra, could you please boost and highly develop my seven soul houses and YGL area. I'm beyond grateful. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. So you'll be focusing on the first soul house that is the at the base of your torso at the perineum. And we will be taking a deep breath in. And as we exhale, we'll be chanting the mantra A. I'll do it once so that you get to know how to do it. Take a deep breath in. A. Okay. And we'll be doing it seven times. So let us just focus on the first soul house. Take a deep breath in. And as we exhale, we chant the mantra A. Hey, 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 hey. Hey, one last time. Hey, relax. And now we go to the second step. Wherein, as we exhale, we'll be chanting the mantra three times. So I'll do it once. Hey, hey, hey. So at the exhalation, all the three times you'll be saying the mantra hey in one exhalation. Okay. So when you're saying the second hey, you can see the light vibrating a little brighter, growing bigger. The third hey is becoming further bigger. The ripples going further and your entire chakra is getting vibrating further. Okay. So let's do it. We'll do this four times. Deep breath in. Hey, hey, hey. Hey, hey, hey. Hey, hey, hey. Hey, hey, hey. Relax. Now we can move on to the second soul house. You'll have one palm on your, in the area below your navel, but above the first soul house, between the two. Visualize beautiful orange light. And the mantra here is Hung. H-U-N-G, Hung. It's written as H-E-N-G, but we pronounce it as H-U-N-G. So we'll do it the same time, the same way, seven times and then four times. So let us start. Focus on your second soul house. Both palms, you can have one over the other at the second soul house. At the Swadishtan Chakra. Take a deep breath in. Hang. Um. 
Hang 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 Hang. One last time. Hang. And we move on to the second step. We'll do the chanting of the hang three times. Be present. Hang, hang, hang. Hang, hang, hang. Hang, hang, hang. Hang, hang, hang. Relax. Now let's move on to the Manipur Chakra, the third soul house. Visualize beautiful yellow light at the navel. One palm on your navel, the other palm remains on your lower abdomen, below the navel. And the mantra here is Hong, H-O-N-G. So let's take a deep breath in. Hong. Oh. 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 Relax. We do the second step now. Be threatened. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh, oh. Relax. Now let's move up. To our heart chakra, the anaha chakra, the fourth soul house. This is the chakra that is the source for healing, for love, compassion, forgiveness. It is your karma center. It is your center for transformation. The mantra here will be A A H. And we'll visualize beautiful green light radiating at the heart chakra. One palm remains on your lower abdomen. The other palm on your heart chakra. The mantra is Ah. Take a deep breath in. Ah. 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 
Relax. So we'll do the second step. Deep breath in. Ah, ah, ah. Ah, ah, ah. Ah, ah, ah. Ah, ah, ah. Relax. As we now move on to the fifth soul house, that is the Vishuddhi Chakra. At the throat, the center for communication, for healing of the thyroid glands. So let's focus on the Vishuddhi Chakra, visualizing nice, beautiful blue light. And the mantra is Shi, it is X I, we pronounce it as. S H I C. Okay. Keep breathing. She. 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 Step two, deep breath in. She, 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 she. Relax. We move on to the Agnya Chakra, the sixth soul house. It's just in front of the eyebrows, in front of your forehead. You can have one palm in front of your forehead, the other palm continues to remain on your lower abdomen. And the mantra here is E, Y, I. We pronounce it as E. Double E, visualize indigo light in your Agnya Chakra, the sixth soul house. The soul house is key for activating the potential brain cells, for increasing concentration, Focus, creativity, and more. So let's start. Deep breath in. E. 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 E E E E 
relax as you move on to the second step deep breath in e e e e e e e e e e Relax. As we move on to the seventh soul house, in Master Shah's teachings, this is the only center which is outside the physical body. So we we'll place our palm a little above our crown. We won't be touching our head. We'll have a little have a little space between the top of our head and our palm. The other palm continues to remain on your lower abdomen, and the mantra here is Wong. W E N G, but we pronounce it as W O N G. Wong. Okay, and we'll visualize beautiful violet light in the Sahasra Chakra, the seventh soul house. This is the soul house that helps us to develop more spiritually and to connect with our higher beings, to connect with the divine, with our shifus, with our angels. Our guardian angels. So let us start. Deep breath in. One. 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 Relax. Go on to the second step. Deep breath in. Wong, 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 wong. wong, wong, wong. Wow, wow, wow. Relax. And now we move on to the space in front of the spinal column. You can see the dotted line. So you can have one palm on your navel, the other palm can be. On the opposite side of the navel, that is called the Ming Men acupuncture point. So one one palm you can place on your navel, the other palm you can place on your Ming Men acupuncture point. And the mantra here we will be chanting is Yo Y O U. We pronounce it as Yo. Okay. So this is the biggest space in front of our body. So most of our blockages come and accumulate on this space. The, any any challenges that we have in the seven soul houses, or even associated with the organs, all those blockages come and accumulate on this space, this biggest space. So when we clear this space, then we are. It's a pathway for us to heal completely. Okay, so one palm on your Ming Men, one palm on your navel. Take a deep breath in. Yo, yo, yo. 
Yo 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 Relax. Move on to the second step. Yo, yo, yo. Yo, yo, yo. Yo, yo, yo. Yo, yo, yo. Relax. You can bring both palms in front of your lower abdomen. Place both palms one over the other. And bring your awareness to the Muladhar Chakra. And as you continue to have your awareness at the Muladhar Chakra, allow me to offer you a blessing as I chant the mantra for the Chi channel, which is called the Energy Channel. That goes from the top, from the bottom. At the Mulada Chakra, it goes up the seven soul houses and comes down in front of the spinal column, coming back to the Mulada Chakra. So allow me to offer a blessing by chanting the mantra for the Chi channel. Visualize the light going up the seven soul houses, the seven chakras, and coming down. The spinal column, from the area in front of the spinal column. <clears throat> and as this light travels up and down, up and down, any blockages that are there in the channel between the seven soul houses are slowly and steadily getting cleansed. So focus on your Muladhar Chakra. Blessings to every participant on the call as appropriate. Start. He hung hung a she won yo. 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 He hung hung a she yo. He hung hung a she won. Yo, he hung on a she. 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 Yo, he hung on a she won. 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 Yo. He hung on a she yo. He hung on a she yo. 
けあんごがひぼんよ。けあんごがひぼんよ。けあんごがひぼんよ。けあんごがひぼんよ。けあんごがひぼんよ。けはごがしぼんよ。けはごがしぼんよ。けはごがしぼんよ。けはごがしぼんよ。へはんほがしわんよ。へはんほがしわんよ。へはんほがしわんよ。けはんごがしよ。けはんごがしわんよ。けはんごがしわんよ。けはんごがしわんよ。よ、けはんほがしぼんよ。よ Bring your awareness to your breath and integrate all of the light that you have received as the blockages got clear. Bring your awareness down to your Muladhar Chakra once again. And whenever you're ready, you can bring your palms together in the prayer position. Gently rub your palms and transfer all of the warmth that generates between your palms. You can place them on your eyes. There is your face, your head, and every part of your body. Gently move your body and come back to the here and now. You. How are you feeling? Anybody would like to share? I am sure. Yes, sir. Thank you so much, Minuji, for your beautiful healing. I have been to Master Shah. I have taken my daughter also many, many times for the healing, and he himself, and he himself has given this healing to my daughter on the stage many, many. Gosa, we can't hear you. You're muted. 
these have been revealed mantras hmm this is not the product of somebody's intellect right and i can share my own experience today hmm that it is using a technical technology whereby you put your hand wherever you put your hand that is where the healing happens that is where mm. the energy goes so mm. when i was putting my hand the hands had become absolutely hot mm. and there was so much of energy being transmitted through the hand into that particular area which was being activated it was indescribable and mm. then umaji what she did was that she chanted these mantras in the cycle so there was and and this chinese system uh, the master sha system is a unique system because it also recognizes the presence of the vai jao this big hollow space which is there and it becomes a conduit where the energy starts moving so it can move in this direction and it can also be moved in the other direction mm. chanted only one uh, uh, cycle of mantras so what happens is that this whole area gets absolutely charged with energy and it is activated but it is something that you have to experience so you have so, to try it out and see how it works for you if so, ram um, uh, yeah lam uh, uh, vam ram yam mm, yeah works for mm. you that is for you if this works for you so much the better you use it whatever works for you you use it is it i is ha- it? i have a feeling uh, for me both the things work yeah but which one to use well like is it so uh, back of your experience okay to be guided by your experience mm mm-hmm. what works mm-hmm. for you you will experience okay uh, okay then mm. and and if it doesn't work for you just leave it that's it. that's fine everything okay. will not work for everybody there are some okay. for whom they have been brought up through many lifetimes in a certain tradition hmm hmm they are addicted to that tradition and only those things which are coming from that tradition will work for them okay it okay. is fine for them okay but there uh, have been spiritual tourists like me who have gone through many traditions yeah so anything that comes up i feel absolutely at home yeah no matter where. and and uh, 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 brahma ji what is the name of, of the master master show yes sir yes. you can uh, you can just google his name i will uh, the spelling uh, i will put it in the group you yeah. can okay Okay. I will right. I will put his website. Okay. Go to the website and read about him. And right. those who are very much interested Uma ji's uh, group the Soul Healing India puts up a program every month which is called uh, it's a I think it's better Uma ji if you introduce that program. Yes, yes, I will. Uh, ah. uh, yeah. yeah. We have a signature program called the Soul Gym. like we go to a physical gym to energize ourselves to build up our body this is a soul gym where uh, we take care of the physical mental emotional spiritual aspects together various practices are done every day on a on a daily basis now sorry we have it for thrice a week now one batch is in the morning at 6:45 to 7:45 and another is from 11:30 to 12:30 and uh, in these we do a lot of different types simple practices which help us to heal ourselves okay and by the by the time the, we finish this particular set of programs by 27th or so i think we can put a, an invite for the soul gym in our yes sure so sure. those who want to experience it yeah. they can register and yeah. do yeah. that yeah there okay. is a monthly honoring uh, subscription uh, of 1200 rupees for one person so but i don't know there are many people here who have just joined kamya would be there too she can tell us how she feels she has <laughs> just joined a couple of months back kamya would you like to share yes master actually soul gym is a uh, word is defined itself that we are gymming for our soul <laughs> to make it stronger and better and uh, 
it's really a very amazing feeling because uh, there are such as things jab hum usko experience karte hain na to shayad wahan pe shabdon ki bahut kami pad jati hai aur kuch experience divine experience aise hote hain ki jo hame experience karne hi chahiye तो सोल जिम एक ऐसी क्लास है कि जब हम उसको करेंगे ना तो हम अपने अंदर इतनी एनर्जी फील करते हैं कि लगता है कि सारे चक्रास और डिवाइन एनर्जीज हमारे साथ हैं और हमको बहुत पुशअप कर रही है लाइफ में हमारी स्पिरिचुअल जर्नी में आगे बढ़ने के लिए हमारे अंदर के जो चक्रास है जिनको हम लोग ना कभी भी जैसे कि जिम में जाके डम्बल्स करते हैं एक्सरसाइज करते हैं पर हमारे इंटरनल ऑर्गेन्स को हम लोग कभी भी एक्सरसाइज नहीं करते तो जब सोल जिम करते हैं ना तो इंटरनल ऑर्गेन्स एक्टिवेट हो जाते हैं <laughs> और वो स्ट्रॉन्ग फील करते हैं जैसे कि हमारे लोअर डैंथियन हो गया उसके लिए एक अलग मंत्रा है जो मंत्रा है जिसको जिससे हम लोग उसको एक्टिवेट करते हैं हार्ट चक्रा है तो ये बस खाली एक वर्ड अलग अलग है कि हम हिंदी में उसको विशुद्धि चक्रा या मतलब मूलाधार चक्रा इस तरह से बुलाते हैं चाइनीज में एक अलग नाम से बुलाते हैं बट ये सारी चीजें लेके एक ही जगह जाती है रास्ते अलग हैं लेकिन लेके सब एक ही जगह जा रही है थैंक यू थैंक यू शेयर समथिंग Jyoti had raised her hand. Yeah, Jyoti has raised her hand. Jyoti, are you hearing us? No. She is not to be found. Abita, can you hear me? Can you hear me, Uma Ji? Yes, yes, Jyoti ji. Yeah, Uma Ji. After you finished the whole thing, I was just sweating a lot, and then after that, my top of the head, the mula, uh, I mean the ah uh, chakra. Uh, chakra was pulsating over there, and I was feeling slightly heavy headed. Mm hmm. So any time you feel a little heavy headed, you can uh. take the center, your middle finger. You put it at the top of your head. Okay. And the uh, middle finger of the other palm, you can put it in your navel okay. and just focus on your feet. Feet. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. And okay. within a couple of uh, between within less than ten seconds, you'll feel totally grounded. You should do the right hand up or uh, nothing. Yeah. Nothing. As like for that. your convenience. As for okay. your convenience. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Thank you so much. It was a divine experience. Thank you. Thank you so much. Uh, Vandana, you wanted to share something. वंदना टन्ना हेलो मोबाइल उमा जी वेन आई वॉज वर्किंग ऑन द सहस्त्र चक्र एंड माई हैंड वॉज अटल हायर ऑन माई हेड इट फेल सो हैवी आई कुड नॉट होल्ड द सेवन टाइम नाइ दर कुड आई होल्ड द फोर Times of three se uh, three sets each. Mm -hmm. I mean, it. I just had to, you know, move it. Is that normal? Because it was, it was absolutely as if there was a surge of energy which I just could not manage to keep my hands straight there, and it felt as if my full pa palm and my shoulder was all heavy. Mm -hmm. It's perfectly okay. It depends. They the experience varies from person to person. So just that your chakras all got activated together. So you could have just brought it down. No, nothing to worry. Nothing okay. to worry. Thank you. Yeah, sure. Thank you. Ah, Maithi, you have unmuted yourself. You want to share something? Yes, sir. Sir, I wanted to ask Uma Ji regarding. Uh, you know, I have been suffering from cellulitis for the past five years, and the doctors and all are saying that there is no cure for it. Although I keep taking antibiotics when it flares up. but it's not going at all and it's really hurting very badly so how could would this help me uh, what whatever you are showing uh, it, you think that could help me in some way i've been attending a lot of brahma kumar's uh, sound healing and for some time it as long as i'm there in the group it really i feel very relieved but once after some time again it flares up and it, So, 
it's some relief, you know, uh, which. Yes, uh, my dear, uh, what Master Shah has offered us is uh, certain portals of light, which are called the Dao Chans or the Dao Calligraphies. Yeah. And uh, I've been empowered to offer transmissions from those portals, okay. so which uh, you can receive for your condition of cellulitis. It is normally yeah. received for any part of the body, organ, organ system, or a condition. So in your case, it can you can receive it for the condition of cellulitis. This is but in the ankles. Yeah. No, yeah. for the condition of it. So, you know, wherever, whichever part of the body. Yeah. Cellulitis yeah. could affect any other part also, right? Yeah, right. Yeah. So, for the condition of cellulitis, you can take it. And uh, you'll have to do a chanting of an affirmation for a minimum of two hours every day. Okay. It's a single line affirmation to be chanted. Yeah. So, if you're interested in it, I, will, I can connect with you for that. There is a Thanks. small honor fee, uh, energy exchange for it. And yeah. uh, we can take that further. Okay. Thank you so much. Thank Most you. Well. Most well. Anybody else? Kavita ji, I hope your questions were all answered. Yeah, kind of. Okay. Kind of means because... Uh, as Brahma ji said that we have to experience the two systems. Right. I have been doing the uh, Indian system. So mm -hmm. this one, I did try once. I was, uh, I did it in another class of mm -hmm. a similar thing. Mm -hmm. And I did try once, but uh, I have to try it more. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> we just, you know, we, all of us have, we, I, at least I believe in trying everything. Like presently now I've gone into mandala therapy and bachelor remedies and I've found that integrating all of that together is becoming so miraculous, really miraculous. So Right. It's, yes. It's good to, you know, integrate yeah, but things. It can also confuse. Uh, not necessarily. I think once you start integrating it, you know, it becomes... You are able to, your body, your soul advises you what to take when. It's just okay. like, you know, going for a wedding and there's a buffet over there, you know. They've got mm. everything. But you know mm. where to go and what to eat, right? Mm. In the same way, we have this buffet here of healing and we can choose what we want. Right. You know, I offer so much of healing. Like the other day, I just jumped into Brahmaji's class because I wanted something to for me to feel relaxed. And mm. being there really helped me a lot. So, you know, we just have to choose. That's it. Yeah. Because in the buffets, usually I do get very confused. <laughs> <laughs> Everything is so good. So, you don't know whether to have Chinese or to have chart or something else. <laughs> okay. uh, there are some messages also. Oh, okay. Uh, eight second. I will read some of them. Uh, Vandana says, very beautiful experience. Sapna Jangra says, gratitude. Sapna wanted to say something I think she had. Raised her hand. She seems to have gone. Mm -hmm. Then uh, Meenakshi Gupta says, thank you so much for this beautiful session. And Jyoti had said the same thing which she shared. Dancy Sharma says, thank you very much. And it... Uh, says a feeling of well-being and being open throughout. Thank you, Annette. And Vinay Srivastavaji says, Thank you, Master Uma, for giving the same vibrational experience as we sing Lam, Vam, Ram, Yam, Hum, Om, Kalike, and back in the Indian system. And Mr. Kaushik, Buddhiraj Kaushik says, all paths lead to the same destination, but can anyone tell two paths together? It's the same question as that of Dr. Kavita. I think it has been answered. Vivasha says, thank you very much for this wonderful experience. Thank you, Viva. Thank you. Uh, thank you, everyone. Thank you for allowing me to share this knowledge of Master Shah with you. Thank you so much. Thank you, Gursa. Thank you very much. Thank you, Master Uma. And uh, I think by, when, by the time we are going to end this uh, this series, we will post the link for 
soul gym. Those who may want to experience the soul gym so that they can join. And How do we join? Huh? How do we join? I will put the link in the group or uh, I will share uh, Umaji's number or Kamudi's number should I share? Anyone, anyone, even anyone. So those who are interested, they can get in touch with uh, either Umaji or Kamudi, and uh, they they will get the link, and they can join. And in case you have any difficulty, you can always get in touch with me, and I will put in, you in touch with <laughs> whatever is needs to be done. So, Thank you. Thank you so much, Umaji. Thank you so much. Close with a Shanti Mantra. Huh? Closing with a Shanti Mantra. Uh, yes, I can do that. Or yes. else if you want to do something, you can do that. No, I think it's okay. You can do the Shanti Mantra. Okay. okay. Thank you. So we'll close with the Shanti Mantra. Om Sarve Sham Swaste Bhavatu Sarve Sham Shanti Bhavatu Sarve Sham Puranam Bhavatu Sarve Sham Mangalam Bhavatu Om Sarve Bhavantu Sukhino Sarve Santu Niramaya Sarve Bhadrani Pashyantu Ma Kashid Dukha Bhave Om Shanti 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 May peace and auspiciousness prevail everywhere. Thank you. Thank you, Maji. Thank you, everyone.